Um, I had a nap the other day, thanks. <laughs> I have to give it up for naps, everybody. <laughs> I said, that was a robust applause for naps. <laughs> Thanks for your support. I mean, they, I'm not, they're not mine. I don't own them, but I support them. And I don't mean like, oh, 20 minutes, I'm refreshed. I'm talking about when you take like a two, three hour, ooh, just chunk out of the day. <laughs> you know you're doing something right in life when you can afford to just nap in the middle of the day. Ooh, that's good. I mean, maybe there's some depression, but. <laughs> why are you trying to sleep through the day, but uh, I like it. I support that behavior, but it's also dangerous because you're rolling the dice when you black out and nap like that, that you like, you know, you fuck yourself up for the rest of the day. I woke up, excuse my F-bomb, <laughs> but it is Friday night, so watch out. Um, but I woke up from this particular nap and I felt really good and I looked around and I was like, my house is nice. This is a beautiful place where I live. And then I realized I'd fallen asleep in Pottery Barn. <laughs> Again. I know, this is the point where you guys get really confused because you're like, Marilyn Rice Cub, you're an international superstar. Why are you even setting foot in the Pottery Barn? You're from Trenton, Michigan. <laughs> Okay, maybe you weren't saying you're an international superstar, and that's fine.